New varieties of loblolly pine trees are being grown as part of a research project to determine whether they will be a good investment for landowners. Foresters at the University of Arkansas's Southwest Research and Extension Center in Hope are calling it a groundbreaking variety trial for loblolly pines, the predominant tree grown in Arkansas by private landowners. While variety trials are common for row crops in Arkansas, this comparative study is a first for the state's timber industry. Well, loblolly pine is a major crop in Arkansas. It generates millions of dollars a year in income for landowners. So we felt like given all of the new varieties of loblolly pine that are available now, we really needed to conduct a variety test on loblolly pine to see what really does work. What are the, what are the varieties that are really gonna be a benefit to landowners? Loblolly pine represents about 70% of the timber harvested in Arkansas each year, with a value of around $300 million. The seedlings in the trial were planted in the spring of 2009. John Berry, a forester with the University of Arkansas's Division of Agriculture, says most of the seedlings were developed in the eastern U.S. and grown under different conditions than found here. The companies that produce these are telling us they can do great things, but we feel like we need to do a variety test as an independent third party, as the university, to, to show whether these seedlings can really live up to the claims. That is the, what we hope for in the long run for the landowners, that these trees will produce a better tree than what is available right now, and that the landowner will be able to make a better profit from these trees. The new varieties are said to grow more quickly, have better stem form and produce a better log. Barry says the goal of the trial is to see if that's the case when the trees are grown in Arkansas. We expect to start seeing results from this test within two to three years. We should be able to see some, of the, some differences in the trees. Really though, it will take us five to six years to really be able to quantify the differences and, and to report this research and to, to show landowners, absolutely, this is, what, this is what's happening with our research. Landowners are welcome to visit the research center anytime to see the new varieties. A field day will be conducted October 14th to showcase the project. It will include sessions on how to establish a pine plantation, select seedlings, and other topics important to landowners.